Boy. Hello viewers and welcome to Emeka Williams Spiritual Tips. My name is Pastor Emeka Williams and today I am coming out with another power-packed spiritual information that will help you deal with the enemy because his operation uproots all my enemies. Are you that man that is under the torment of some enemies, some evil people, some wicked people? They've made life miserable for you. They've made life so hard and unbearable for you. And you are looking for a way to hit them back. Then this video is for you. Have you been wondering how you can torment your enemies and make them feel the pains they've made you go through? Have you been thinking and wondering what can I do in order to destroy my enemies? in order to afflict the enemies back, in order to pay them back in their own coin. If you are that brother, you are that sister in this kind of situation, you have been held on your neck by the enemies and you've suffered for a very long time and you want your freedom, then this video is for you. I am going to teach you a very powerful but simple spiritual tips a recipe that will help you unleash a very strong devastating blow to that wicked enemy of yours in this assignment you are going to be needing few kitchen items number one you will need your onion an onion is going to be a very important ingredient for this particular assignment the number two thing you are going to need is you will need Pepper. Don't forget, we are talking about tormenting your enemies, afflicting your enemies, revenging the evil they have done against, sending back their wickedness back to sender, tormenting them to destruction. Pepper will be needed. Then you're going to need a small photograph of the target enemy, a small photograph. Of the target enemy you're going to need that then what else are you going to need you are going to need vinegar you see vinegar this is the one i've been using this is my personal own my own uh, for my personal use vinegar you need vinegar then you are going to need any kind of liquor at all liquor you're going to get yourself a liquor that is going to be any brand of liquor you get a liquor then you're going to also be needing one stick of white candle you need a stick of white candle what else are you needing in this assignment you are going to need a glass jar that has a lead cover i don't have a glass jar at hand that is why i'm using this uh container with a cover to demonstrate why will you need a glass jar that has a lead cover because of the candle okay then you will be needing your kitchen knife so when you look at these ingredients that we need for this particular assignment you will understand that the mm -mm, the assignment is a bomb it's a super heater and when you hit that enemy it's going to shake that enemy it's going to keep the enemy so troubled that the enemy will remove hand from everything about you this one will make your enemy suffer daily now before i proceed on how you are going to combine these ingredients to generate a very formidable spiritual force to strike the enemies if this is your first time of coming in contact with this face my name remains pastor emeka williams welcome to our youtube channel on this channel we teach and learn on purely spirituality and nature we teach you how you can use natural ingredients connecting to your spiritual energies frequencies properties and vibration to help you solve your life challenges the channel is a family where everybody is somebody everybody is important you touch one you touch all but you have to become a bona fide member of this family by simply subscribing to our channel how do you subscribe look at the right hand side of this video down below you will see a red subscribe button 
click on it and put your notification bell to all so that whenever i upload a new video you will be notified with immediate effect to my returning subscribers double thumbs up and to god almighty thank you for being god and for everything you have done for us in the mighty name of jesus christ now when you have gotten all these equipment that i've told you these ingredients i've mentioned a four time you bless them then when that is done the first thing you're going to do is get your jar when you have gotten your jar the first thing that goes into that jar is the photograph of the target enemy and don't forget when you have the photograph of the target enemy at the back of it you write the name of that enemy then you put the photograph in the container when you have put the photograph in the container what next do you do you get your onion now as you are slicing this onion you will be slicing this onion with that target enemy in your mind as in you are slicing that your target enemy you abc because you have troubled and tormented me as i slice this onion I slice you into pieces. Okay? You slice you. I slice your nerves. I cut your bones into pieces. I cut off your neck. I dismantle you. I disembalm all the members of your body. You know, you cut the onion into pieces and pour it into the jar. Then what goes in next? You get your pepper. You pour your pepper. Now, I don't have the time to be grinding this pepper, but you can slice the pepper or you can even use grinded pepper. You pepper that enemy. Pepper them with affliction. Pepper them with trouble. Pepper them with pain. Pepper them with suffering. As the onion is sliced, you will feel that the, the, there is a sensation that the, the onion is entering into your eyes. And when that happens, it react, makes your eyes to react and tears may begin to drop from your eyes. Let's problems that will bring tears out of the eyes of that enemy begin to visit that enemy and when you have put the pepper what do you do you get your vinegar hey wait uh -huh. you get your vinegar you pour some quantity of that vinegar. You have to pour enough quantity of vinegar that will cover the picture and also cover the content of this jar. Then when that is done, what next sh should you do? You are going to open your Bible. You read Psalm 109 from verse 1 to the end over that jar. Do not forget, you have not put the last item into this, which is the liquor. And of course, you know that liquor intoxicates. But before I tell you what you're going to do with that liquor and how you apply it, after you have read your Psalm 109, let me advertise small. On this channel, we have spiritual products to sell, for sale. Locally, organically produced by me, with you at the back of my mind, to help you solve your spiritual problems easier than ever. We have the cost breaking soap, road opening soap, back to sender soap, we have the anti-witchcraft soap. We have the anti-witchcraft oil. 
we have the anti-witchcraft cream we also have the favor soap we have the love and attraction soap but adventure you are that person that have moving object moving all over your body i have tried all kind of medication and it's not going it's a spiritual thing and needs spiritual medication we have the april above plus spiritual detox that will help you remove that moving object from your body at the snap of the finger oh yes some of you who are watching this video that has bought any of my items my products can attest it to my claims that my products are potent and result giving oh yes don't worry we ship to every country all you need to do is call me on whatsapp or chat me on whatsapp let's discuss on modalities how you can make your order and get your shipment delivered to your doorstep by either fedex or dhl i'll be dropping my phone number at the end of this video but adventure you've been trying to solve some spiritual problems some challenges yourself and it seems the energy level is not strong enough to take care of such matters and you need a professional that is why i am here consult me either my whatsapp by call or by chat let's discuss on how i can come in to help you but do not forget in spirituality nothing is free even in free time god bless you as you continue with this powerful spiritual recipe that will help you destroy your enemies at the snap of the finger yes when you have put the picture the onion the pepper the vinegar what do you put then you now get your wine your your liquor to intoxicate the enemies with a problem they will be so intoxicated that they will begin to create problems for themselves you pour the liquor ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. problems confusion affliction sorrow pain will begin to invade the camp of your enemies so don't forget before you pour the liquor you would have read psalm 109 over the content of the glass jar don't go and use plastic i am using this for demonstrational purpose then you cover it now we are why i said don't use plastic this is the point for why i told you not to use plastic you are not going to get your white candle you will lit the white candle then you place it on the jar and put it on allow the candle to burn on its own completely to the end over that jar by so doing the wax of the candle the remnant will just flow all over the jar and cover and seal the jar i am telling you by the grace of god if you try out this recipe you will put that enemy that been troubling you and your family to a perpetual and permanent place that will make it impossible for them to come after you again please if what i've done in this video is interesting and i've impressed you click the like button click the share button and subscribe to the ch our channel if you have not done so already and please kindly also hit the super thanks button to show your support for the growth of this ministry may god bless you write your comment at the comment section down below i am open for communication till we meet again in my next video my phone number remains plus two three four eight one three one three four three six two seven stay blessed i love you and god loves you more